Borneo is home to one of the greatest concentrations of orchids of anywhere in the world. The Borneo Orchid Expedition takes you to see many of the island's most incredible orchids in their natural habitats. Our 16-day itinerary takes you from the misty summit of Mount Kinabalu through beautiful mossy cloud forest to the depths of tall rainforests so you can admire and photograph a vast range of orchids from the highlands to the lowlands. First on our itinerary is a visit to the Bacau National Park by speedboat. Bacau is home to dry coastal heath forest, which is filled with spectacular orchids. As well as many carnivorous pitcher plants, and beautiful proboscis monkeys. We then travel to the world famous orchid gardens and nurseries in the foothills of Mount Kinabalu. Here we can explore the extensive orchid collections and often the rare Paphiopetalum Rothschildianum is in flower. Along with the exquisitely beautiful Paphiopetalum loei. The gardens have well laid out trails that are home to a plethora of other spectacular orchid species. After the gardens, we then begin a challenging two-day ascent up Mount Kinabalu itself. We spend a night up at 3,000 meters and then have an early start for those that want to, to climb right up to the mountain summit to explore the ultra highland habitat where we can find extreme orchids growing. As we begin our descent back down from the mountain top, we return back through beautiful highland forest, home to hundreds more orchid species, including Spataglottis, Trichoglottis and Cylogeny, as well as countless others. And of course, not to mention the spectacular carnivorous pitcher plant, Nepenthes velosa. Our next stop is a well-managed landslide habitat in the shadow of Mount Kinabalu. This area is home to a different range of orchid species growing in mountain scrub vegetation. It's also home to one of the biggest carnivorous pitcher plants in the world, a plant that can trap animals as big as rats. We then drive deep into the interior of Sarawak to visit Mount Murud, home to one of the greatest diversities of orchids and pitcher plants in all of Borneo. After several hours driving, we reach the remote Kelebet Highlands, home to spectacular views of the surrounding mountains, and famed for its cooler climate, temperate fruit, and beautiful rice paddies that are still ploughed by water buffalo. The next morning, we begin the ascent of Mount Murud itself, and almost immediately were surrounded by orchids, including intricate and beautiful jewel orchids that grow on the ground along the trail. And a little higher up, we find colonies of the spectacular carnivorous pitcher plant, Nepenthes heriliana. One of the most beautiful of all pitcher plants, with its strikingly colored, stripy peristome. Here, we also find the large and elegant traps of Nepenthes muridensis. And growing alongside are the intricate and colorful diminutive plants 
Nepenthes meloensis, and Nepenthes tentaculata. The upper slopes of Mount Murud are truly orchid heaven. The stunted bonsai forest and rock gardens are literally dripping with orchids. After a full day of exploring the upper slopes of Mount Murud, the next day we return and begin the descent. So how do you feel seeing Miluensis? Fantastic. I'm absolutely <laughs> thrilled. Oh. <laughs> made my day. Oh, Much but... more so than it had already been made. So. We then drive back towards Mount Kinabalu and towards our final destination, Mount Trasmadi. Along the way, we can stop at reserves to see giant Rafflesia flowers. And on reaching Mount Trasmadi, we trek out into the forest and begin our last climb. Once again, we see a wide diversity of beautiful orchids. and we camp out on the slopes of the mountain for the night. And for those that want to, an early start around the campfire reveals unforgettable sunrise views as the epic scale of Borneo's wilderness is revealed in the early morning light. We then return to climbing and ascend up into some of the most beautiful and pristine mossy cloud forest anywhere in the world. Here, Every tree trunk and twig is literally covered with moss, orchids and lichen. And amongst them is the stunning Nepenthes macrophylla. And the beautiful Nepenthes lowii. The views from the summit are simply breathtaking, especially as the clouds roll over. After a full day of exploring, it's time to descend and return back down to the lowlands, concluding our epic expedition, exploring the incredible diversity of orchids of Borneo. To secure a place on this expedition, or to learn more about our many different eco-friendly trips to other amazing destinations, please visit our website.